Alrighty, here we are at my Warner Road Parmelia renovation flip. It's completely finished, it's been staged, and I just want to give you a look through the property. So, let's have a look. So from the outside, garden beds have been mulched, obviously house has been painted and all the rest of it. If you remember, it was a sort of a pinky colour before. Uh, the grass isn't as green as I'd like. There's a few faded patches, which I'm not overly ecstatic about, but it is what it is. These were the two windows at the front, which were replaced. So that was a bit of an expensive exercise. Five grand blowout for me to replace that corner window, that one there, and one in the uh, one in the bedroom at the back. So yes, everything was painted, basically surf mist, and then all the gutters and facial. Um, all monument so good contrast popular color all right so it looks better on the inside so this reno cost me about 55k so come in it's all been staged now so this is the uh, the living area it's only a small three by one this home and then we've got dining so yeah, so these are the replaced windows. So if you remember, they were actually timber windows. All the windows in this house were timber frames. So these two, oh, and the back one, completely rotted. So it's come up really good. Staging people always make a, um, yeah, they always do a really good job um, in utilizing the space and just really finishing it off. Got to put the blind up for the kitchen, but that's all right. So this is my kitchen. The thing I'm not a fan of is having the pantry there, but just the, how pokey this kitchen was, it was difficult to fit in a pantry. Probably could have put it on this side, maybe. Um, but look, that's, it is what it is. So remembering I, put, I purchased this house for 290 and uh, probably expecting around the sort of 450 So laundry, just on a basic laundry. A lot of my renos I've done in the past sort of like bench and stone top and that, but I've sort of, in these cheap areas, sort of gone away from it because it's typically investors buying and I don't really think they appreciate the laundry anyway. They're only really chasing the rental yield, so as long as it looks clean, neat and tidy. So this is one of the bedrooms. There's not even any robes in this house, so, but the rooms aren't a bad size. Toilet, bathroom. So we've got the uh, glass shower screen. These shower screens cost me about 300 and something bucks, so I try and put them in most of the time. They just finish it off the bathroom really well. This is the biggest bedroom, so this would be the master. So it's a pretty decent sized bedroom, but there's no robe, so um, it is what it is. It's not really worth me putting robes in. You just, you know, it's gonna cost you a few grand to put robes in. Not really gonna get any return on investment for that. And this is the other bedroom. So yeah, so not bad size bedrooms, but yeah, no robe. So you've got to take into consideration. I've got to put chest of drawers or something like that in there. Um, so yeah, obviously, you know, out, as far as landscaping, I put in, you know, grass and just mulch, really basic, didn't even put retic in. So, so limited spend on the, uh, on that. I've actually just realised my painters didn't paint my letterbox. I don't know how that was missed. Okay. Um, coming through. And this is the outside. So I've done nothing. I've just tied, well I have. I've had it all just tidied up. Probably should have mulched that garden bed. Gardener was meant to do that. Hasn't been done. And then this here. Rather than mourning it all because I wasn't reticking it and all the rest of it, I just cut it back. Which I know this property is going to be. And this was a pretty tacky patio. I really sort of ummed and ahed about whether I just pull it down or not. Um, but then we just ended up painting it and just leaving it. So it doesn't look the best. But once again, I'm not going to get my return on investment by spending you know six or seven or eight k on a on a patio. So um, yeah, just use what we had and just painted it. 
So, so yeah, so that's uh, that's the home. It's been staged, obviously. Photos are today, three o'clock, uh, Perth time, and then it should be online by tonight. Uh, I think the agent was talking about putting it on from from four fifty nine. I've done my fees at four fifty. Um, there's sales evidence between sort of the four fifty to four eighty mark. It is on a bit of a busier road. That's the only downfall. It's not a busy road. It's just a bit of a thoroughfare through the suburbs. So, um, yeah. So anyway, um, all up. Yeah, Renault cost four. Sorry, what Renault cost fifty five k. We'll uh, I'll check back in and I'll let you know the outcome once it's once it's sold. Thank you.